day 15. Yesterday was Monday, which is the day when I always get my shit together. So I set up my new sketchbook for the week and I'm gonna show it to you. So we are in week three. Piece of advice, which I'm gonna write down at the end of the week. And then I have my sleep tracker. Oh my God, I slept so well last night. 10 out of 10. My new roommate, Olivia, who's one of my best friends, doesn't have sheets yet. So she's been sleeping with me and she goes to bed so early, like two, that's pretty early for me. Law of attraction quotes. Monday, my quote was, good now is better than perfect later. Tim Ferriss habit tracker this is like really similar to last week oh oops i forgot to fill some of this stuff in i definitely did that i didn't do that i did this i did this okay what gets measured gets managed tony robbins quote boom i want to be early to all my meetings i want to send agendas to people before i meet with them i want to communicate the feeling of increase in every interaction that i have i want to articulate my purpose honestly and explicitly with people through my words and body language i want to communicate energy to myself through my posture and how i look at myself in the mirror and i want to lucid dream every single Single night which by the way I had a lucid dream this week huge milestone basically I was on the train last week and I thought I saw this girl that I went to elementary school with but I hadn't seen her since we were like 11 and I was like no way that's her and then in my dream a couple nights ago I saw this girl and so then I knew I was like oh I know this is a dream because there's no way that this girl is like popping up right now so then I realized I was lucid dreaming and I flew among other things this is another week map. Basically, I'm gonna write down what the main milestone was every single day this week. And then at the end of the week, I'll write down what next week is about and what were the 20% of things that I did this week that yielded 80% of my results. I'm re-listening to this book called Essentialism by Greg McKeown right now. It is such a good book and I wanted to make a sketchbook spread that reflected some of those concepts. His whole premise is less but better. I just made a really simple Tony Robbins RPM map. RPM stands for Rapid Planning Method. It's basically the anti-to-do list. So instead of writing 100,000 things that you get so overwhelmed by that you need to do today, you just write three simple columns. This is your outcome or your what. This is your purpose or your why. And this is your map, i.e. massive action plan i.e. how what why how basically the idea is my job is to establish the what and the why the universe comes up with the how for me once i'm clear enough about what i want to do and why i want to do it the path is shown to me and i just follow it being clear on what you want and why you want it equals intuition that's your to-do list so my outcome my purpose my result what is the dozing cause when i do it okay let's just take an example my outcome is i want to have emailed three completed new songs to my manager by the end of february okay why do i want that it goes along with our agenda for our year. It allows me to process what I'm feeling and express myself through art in a way that feels really cathartic and good to me. Once these songs are completed, we can begin mapping out our new live set. We'll be almost finished with our record that we're working on and we can start shopping it to labels and decide how we want to release it. We can start touring it. There's so many reasons why I want to have this outcome completed. Then what I would basically do is set a timer for like five minutes and jot down every single thing that comes to mind for how I could get that done. The ones that stick out to me, I will circle and that's my plan. That's it. 